Good morning to the Monday morning inspiration for the joy of creation. And it is Christmas Day, December 25th. Merry, 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 happy, joyful, magical, fantastic, phenomenal, outrageous, <laughs> opulent, festive. Did I say magical? <laughs> <laughs> Christmas to you all um, out there and really I'm, I'm wishing you mm, lots of beautiful energies whatever you are asking for actually what Joa what are you I see something there so I see I think the Christmas tree <laughs> and we have actually amazing gusts of wind here today we had a dusting of fresh snow. It is really cold, like really cold, like uh, six degrees Fahrenheit, which is minus 15 Celsius. I always have to get the Celsius numbers sort of in Fahrenheit numbers. I'm like, yeah, six degrees Fahrenheit. It's okay. But then when I listen to, oh no, 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 no. Let's see. What is this in Celsius? It's like, Oh, it's cold. <laughs> so welcome to the Monday morning inspiration. And um, huh, I, I had a theme today for um, today's session and it's you are light. And what does this mean? You are light. Mm. And maybe you have never acknowledged that. Like, did ever anybody tell you that you are light too? And, you know, do you acknowledge you? Or do you mostly judge you and criticize you? And, um, yeah, you are. What if you are everything? What if you are light? And this time of the year, I have my tea here. I, I love my tea. And I've been drinking green tea forever and I just love it. So there's honey in there. And um, Joelle, what are you moving around there? <laughs> Sorry, I cannot see it all. Oh, there's, there's a painting in the background. <laughs> so what was I saying? Oh yeah, this time of the year, you know, <clears throat> what if it is not the darkest time of the year? Sure, the days are shorter and we just went beyond the 21st of December, the shortest day. But like when, when, when you look outside and we have snow on the grounds, it is so full of light. There is actually more light when you measure it. There is more light now than there is during the summer. And how easy... For those of you who go skiing, like you know how easy it is to get burned while skiing, right? So there is a lot of light. And it is also the time where in, in pagan cultures, um, they, they celebrated the return of the light. So what if this is actually an amazing, an amazing time to, to look inside, to, to look at what is look inside look like sort of take your inventory of of you like okay what what have i created what what can i be grateful for for me like and how does this have like what does this have to do with the joy of creation well well what can you create like what if this is actually sort of like a, hmm a time of the year where we can also um, look at what would we like to create and we can also plant seeds for the future, right? It's like everything is actually, is actually active. Nature, I love looking at nature and nature is such an inspiration for, for me, for creating, for painting, for writing, like the space that nature is, 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 amazing so so nature is not dead now nature is not like sad now right 
there, there is such joy. When you look at the birds, even at minus 15 degrees Celsius, six degrees Fahrenheit, are they depressed, sitting around depressed in the trees? No, they, they, they are happy. The eagles are wild. They look for food and they circle. They are, they are not sad. They create. So what can we create? And I love looking at the energy also. When we, when we see this, this time of the year as um, dark and negative and horrible and depressed, what is this creating for our life? What are we actually choosing there? And what other choice can you all make? What choice can you make that nobody else is making? Could you choose happiness even in the winter? I love it. I love it. I also love like dressing with fun. It's not, I'm not giving up the fun for, for anything and anyone. And, you know, uh, one of my yoga teachers used to say, there is no bad weather. There is just the wrong clothes. I mean, if you hang on to your summer dresses, you might not be very happy right now. But if you have fun clothes that are warm and you, I love wearing layers, for instance, and, and play, play with it. And also with your body, play. Like what if we can create fun and joy and enjoyment during the winter season, right? So it is the joy of creation. And what if you look at your light? What is it that is you? What, what, what is so amazing about you? What is so unique about you? You are the only one of your kind. Hey, <laughs> is this a new information for you? You are the only one of your kind. And what if there's really something amazing and cool and glorious about you, even if you're a bastard? <laughs> Did I say that? <laughs> I was thinking about ingenious bastards. You know, the humor about everything, laugh about you, laugh about people who choose like frenzy and stress and anxiety what if we can laugh about it and have a good cup of tea or the other day i found just the most amazing hot chocolate enjoy it hot chocolates you may not want to drink it although i drink it too during the summer but it might not be like now the hot chocolate with the spices you know the cardamom and pepper and cinnamon and this or chai tea i love chai tea and then I add really mm, the whipped cream to it, like the fat, you know, it's like, hey, what does your body love, right? And really enjoy it. Enjoy it. You are here. Might as well enjoy it. It takes courage to be here. So how courageous are you? It takes strength to be here. It, yes, definitely. And have you ever looked at how strong you are? You are here, hey, and what would you like to create? I'm gonna soon start also um, some videos about painting, how like showing you a couple of things and just how do I start a painting? I have all these paintings here around me that are already, some are finished and signed and already. And um, this one here is almost, ready I just have to sign it and then it can go out into the world yay what can we create together what can I create with the paintings where would they like to go so functioning from question rather than concluding oh it's the dark time of the year what if it really is not what if it is actually a really great time as I said to take inventory look at what you have created and really celebrate that celebrate it what have you created that the what you think might be insignificant what if you don't make it insignificant but you have created it whatever it is rather than judging it judgment will always destroy 
acknowledgement is creation. When you acknowledge you and what you have done and created this year, who have you inspired? That might also be something amazing to look at. Who have you inspired? You know what? If you inspired one person, if you change their trajectory i don't know whether i say that right right now <laughs> when you have maybe changed the course of their life by taking them out of a depression or by by having given them a gift that totally blew their minds into something greater that they you know when we do things that people don't expect when we are willing to be the the unexpected catalyst for something greater in other people's lives that changes everything so when you have inspired one person you are brilliant because that will ripple out into everything the change that that makes for one person when they they see that they can choose happiness. Let's take that as an example. They choose happiness. Will this have an effect on their children? Will this have an effect on their partner? We are not little tiny blurbs. What if you are a really powerful creator? I got to take a sip of my tea. Hmm. What if you are brilliant? A brilliant being and with that information <laughs> with that news flash <laughs> what can you create what can you create people have inspired me by with just one kind word in a moment when where I was really desperate when i was really sad or i didn't know i had no idea what's going to be next i was sort of uh now what and people stepped up and said a word to me three words four words you are going to be okay it's six words right or oh, whatever you are going to be okay You are beautiful. You are. You are beautiful. You are light. You are light. Mm, you are light. You are light. Mm, you are light. You are light. You're not the things your family did. You're not the thoughts that are in your head. I love that song, India Ari. And I just changed the lyrics a little bit. You are not the thoughts in your head. You are not the color of your skin. You are not what your family did. You are not what your country did. I love saying that too. You are not. You are not, it has nothing to do with you. You are the one who can choose. You are the light. You are an infinite being. So what can you choose? What can you create? What's fun for you? Choose something that is fun for you, all right? And on that note, if you don't have any questions right now, are there any questions? <laughs> on that note i i let you go for today i see you in a week on the monday morning inspiration and we keep rolling every monday morning i will also have guests and i will post more of the themes and you know i'm more like a butterfly like i don't set the the production line <laughs> it's it's a creation a hmm hmm nonsensical non-linear more chaotic creation but the chaos of a butterfly you know the chaos of the bee the chaos of the birds 
Wow. I adore you all. Thank you so much for watching and wow, have a wonderful life. You are the light. Bye. <laughs>